Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you guys don't know me, my name is Jessie and in this session, pag-uusapan natin on how to fund your Binance account. There are three ways to fund. One is from coins.ph, second is from P2P, and third is direct from your Visa card. So, Visa card means um, your debit or your credit card. So, titignan natin ang difference between these three kung magkano yung makukuha natin and kung paano natin ita-transfer to uh, to our Binance wallet. Naglaan po ako ng 5,000 pesos on each fund para malaman po natin kung magkano yung makukuha natin. I will um, share you my screen in a few minutes from my phone and my computer screen. <music> So, punta po kayo sa coins.ph. Che-check nyo po sa peso wallet. Meron na pong 6,015. Actually, may 1,000 po ako na pending dyan. Pero, as per this example, 5,000 po ang ilalagay natin. We will convert it to XRP. You need to press the icon crypto. And then, lagay nyo po yung 5,000 pesos. And then, change it to XRP. Every time po na magko-confirm kayo, nagbabago po kagad siya. Uh, successfully converted 5,000 PHP to 167 PHP. So, makikita nyo po ang 1067 is equal to 4744.4. Ang the rest po kasi napunta na yun sa transaction fee. Just click on your wallet and your fiat and spot. Dito nyo po makikita yung balance ninyo. So, just click on deposit. Since mag-deposit po tayo ng XRP, we need to change our coin to XRP. Ripple. So, kailangan po i-enter both tag and address data which are required to deposit XRP to your Binance account successfully. Ito po yung XRP address and XRP tag. Punta po ulit tayo sa coins.ph and then scan po yung XRP QR code. So, iscan po natin. And then, itatay po natin ang destination tag. Let's put the full amount. So, meron pong XRP fee na 0.000045. Slide to confirm. And then, i-enter po ninyo ang code na from your email. Ko ano po yung registered email nyo sa coins.ph. And then, press done. So, ayun na po. Success, you have sent 167. So, kapag pumunta po ulit kayo sa Binance, Mag-wait lang po tayo ng ilang minutes for the deposit history na mag-appear. So, itatry naman po natin ngayon ang P2P. Pipili lang po tayo ng P2P. Pwede po natin mapalitan ang currency to PHP. And then, punta lang po tayo sa P2P. P2P trading uh, from under sa buy crypto and then ang fiat money po natin should be in PHP since uh, ang account po natin ay galing sa PHP. Click lang po natin ang refresh. Tapos magbabay po tayo in amount of 5,000 pesos. So, sa P2P po pala, wala siyang XRP. Coins na pwedeng mabili is USDT, BTC, BUSD, BNB, 
Ethereum, and DAI. So, pipiliin po natin ang USDT kasi mas marami po siyang advertisers. So, pipili lang po tayo dito. Click crypto po yung pinakamura. Dito naman po is, uh, ang difference is 1 peso, 0.95 Pero dito, ang maganda is Gcash siya kay J Crypto. So, ang pipiliin ko po is kay J Crypto kasi mas gusto ko po na hindi bank transfer kundi Gcash na lang. Click po natin yung information niya. So, makikita po natin na ang average release time niya is 2 minutes para makita natin na 2 minutes na release na yung fund. So, let's buy po USDT sa kanya. So, 5,000 pesos. Ang marireceive po natin sa 5,000 pesos is 96.24 in coins, it's USDT. So, buy USDT. So, click lang po natin. So, ito na po, please confirm that you have successfully transferred the money to the seller through the following method po, which is Gcash. Ito po yung number niya. And payment to be made should be within 15 minutes time frame lang po. So, kailangan ma-confirm kagad natin. So, ang gagawin natin is pupunta ulit po tayo sa Gcash. Tatype lang po natin ang number niya. And yung amount po is 5,000. And then, lagay lang po natin as optional message na Binance P2P. And then next, ayan na po, uh, you are about to send 5,000 pesos sa kanya. And then confirm. So, ayun na po, nasend na natin yung 5,000 pesos sa kanya, kay J Crypto. And then, uh, transfer next. So, ayun na po, uh, please confirm that the payment has been made to the seller. So, ito na po, nag-transfer na tayo. And then, press confirm. So, hintay lang po natin. It says to be released in 15 minutes. So, makikita po natin, P2P has been completed. The seller has released 96.24 USDT to your P2P wallet. So, kapag nag-check po tayo ng wallet natin under P2P, so, ayun na po, makikita natin na nag-release na po na 96.24 USDT kagad si J. Crypto. Isa pa pong way, mag-deposit and withdraw. Uh, ito po, nakalagay dito, visa. So, if meron po kayong visa card, pwede po kayong makabili direct ng cryptocurrency through your visa card by Bitcoin here. So, ang bibilhin po natin is PHP, Philippine Peso, 5,000 pesos. At ang bibilhin po natin ay, dito po makikita lang natin yung mga applicable. So, bilhin po natin ang repo directly from, from Visa Cards RP. Repo. So, ito po yung amount na mabibili po natin using uh, 5,000 pesos. Nakasave na po yung Visa Card ko dito. And then, click buy XRP. So, ito na po. 1 XRP is 29.22 pesos. Meron lang po tayo 60 seconds to confirm. And 1 XRP is 29.19. So, confirm. I hope po na may natutunan kayo dun sa mga naipakita kong way sa inyo on how to fund your Binance account. And please do let me know on the comment below kung mag-open ba kayo ng Binance account or kung ano yung preferred nyong way of funding your Binance account. And sana po may natutunan kayo and we'll see you soon. Bye!